tutorial video on how to add a switch to a light in your RV fixture. Yeah! <laughs> um, so you can add any residential light fixture to an RV. A lot of people don't know that. But um, all you need to do is use a 12 volt light bulb in place of a regular light bulb. And then that makes it work in an RV. Here are the things that you need. You need a light fixture. I got these from a company called Beautiful Halo. I wouldn't necessarily recommend them, but, though, because it took me like a month to get those in, so I would go with like Amazon or something else. Um, this is the little bracket that attaches to the ceiling, um, and these screws attach the actual light to the bracket. Um, we've got a 12 volt light bulb. These are like cute little Edison bulbs that I got from Amazon. Um, these are the screws to attach the bracket to the ceiling. We've got switches. Uh, these came in a pack of five from Amazon and they have a little cap so you can actually like put it through the light and then screw the cap piece on. You'll need some wire connectors. The ones that I, the lights that I got didn't come with any so I, we bought a pack of these. Um, you'll need a Phillips head to actually attach the light to the bracket and then a drill. Um, we used one of these drill bits to actually put the hole in the light. Um, I'm not sure the proper way to do that, so there might be actually like a metal drill bit that you're supposed to use. This worked just fine. So whatever you have, you know, go for it. Original lights look like, um, they have a little switch on them and that's why I had to include a switch on the new ones. Otherwise the lights would just stay on all the time. Go ahead and put it in there, I'm filming. To explain how this works, this black wire from the switch will hook to the black wire on the light and then the other switch wire will hook to the black wire on the ceiling. Alright. So you'll twist the wires together. Put a cap on it. Yep. Here it's a wire connector. You'll add the wire connector to it. And you just twist that on. And this will kind of tuck in here. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you want to make sure you cut off the power to your RV, um, not just the plug, but also the battery. So I'm going to show you how to do that next. looks like um, you'll have to strip these off with uh, some wire cutters uh, to expose some of the wire. Hook the white together and the black together from the light to the ceiling and you just do the same thing that you did with the switch you twist the wires together and then you put a wire connector on them
Let me lower it just a little bit. Mm -hmm. So you just put the screws into the side. Um, we usually start these off with our fingers because it's just a little bit easier to get them in there and then finish it with the Phillips head. Are you ready to do it? Light bulb in. It's our little 12 volt Edison pretty bulb. Bulb. There you go. My husband is mocking me. You should have. You're working late. 